just a few hours away from the fireworks display at Riverfront Park tonight. The park's Twitter account posted this picture of the mortars ready to fire. Pyro crews are all ready. The show in Riverfront Park starts at 10 o'clock sharp. You can see it through over much of the city. While we all love the spectacle of the fireworks on the 4th of July, not everyone celebrates Independence Day the same way. KXOY 4's Brittany Paris working for you live in Riverfront Park. Brittany got a call from a neighbor wanting to remind people that for those with PTSD, this holiday can be a stressful one. That's right, Melissa, and she reached out to us because people in her neighborhood started lighting off fireworks a few days ago, earlier than they ever have before. And on 4th of July, when so many people will be celebrating their independence with fireworks, those noises can be nerve-wracking, even scary, for people with PTSD. Nancy Sundock has lived in her Spokane home for the better part of four decades. People just need to think more about their neighbors. She usually loves her neighborhood, except when the 4th of July comes around. Because of a near drowning back in 2010, Nancy suffers from PTSD. So those sounds of freedom create anxiety for both Nancy and her medical alert dog, Asher. The loud, surprising booms can trigger painful memories. When I'm lighting it off, I know that it's going to go off so I can prepare my nervous system. But if you aren't expecting them, fireworks can be a shock to the system. I would love to lighten up if it didn't mean that I had to sit and shake like this for several hours. Spokane Assistant Fire Chief Brian Schaefer says you shouldn't be using fireworks at home anyway. Within the city boundaries, the city of Spokane boundaries, there are no fireworks, including sprinklers, allowed within our jurisdiction. And getting caught with them? could cost you more than you think. The fine uh, starts at $513 as a misdemeanor and then grows from that point. If you're using fireworks that start a fire, you'll likely be the one footing the bill for the damage and the cost of firefighters and police who respond. There really is no such thing as safe and sane fireworks. Someone you want to report who is using those illegal fireworks? Call Crime Check. That number's on your screen. 456-2233. And Melissa, your best and safest bet to watch fireworks is right here tonight at Riverfront Park. The show starts at 10 o'clock and runs for about 25 minutes. Live at Riverfront Park tonight, I'm Brittany Paris, KXLY4 News.